Hello again, it's Priscilla Battel in Spring Hill, Florida at Expressionist Art Studio Gallery. And when part one ended, the colors were brilliant and it was wet and it was beautiful. And I'm not super satisfied with how this worked out. So I'm probably just going to say all bets are off. And give myself permission to do whatever I want. Which at this point is going to start with adding some lines in hot pink and some more lines in that hot pink by the way is actually a neon pink from folk art and I think I'm going to do what I did recently with another painting and just add the colors that I like where I like them and then go back in and decide at that point if I want to swipe anything or not. Because right now I just need some art therapy and this is going to be it. Just put colors where I want to. And give myself permission if I want to just leave some lines to do that. if I can't put some darks in there. I want some turquoise, but I'm kind of chicken about doing it. I am kind of having a good time. I'm going to use some Anita's White Metallic, I think, which is a little dangerous because I trimmed the top out of this. Maybe I have a smaller top. Yes. Smaller top, bigger bottle, smaller top. Chances are very good that I will do some swiping with the Anita's White Metallic. I want to put some gold in here too. I might wind up putting some dots in. Looks like they want to be in anyway. I'm just going to keep going. Here I'm going to try and put some of the turquoise in, which is actually cobalt blue from Artist Loft, metallic. I want some black too, but I think the black cell activator is going to have to be the start of that process. Not, I have, I have no sureness at all of what I'm doing. But I do watch a lot of artists that are not paint pouring artists. And I didn't used to be a paint pouring artist, so I'm hopeful that my usual abstract self will just return. And who knows? I mean, really, I could just leave this the way it is. But part of me definitely wants, part of me definitely, yeah, part of me wants to swipe. Very much. I think that can have. I'm still having a good time now, so I don't guess I'm going to stop until that stops being the case. I have some neon folk art that has a lot of Anita's white metallic added to it so it's a very pale purple and lumpy it looks like that was weird yeah let's get those out of there I have a pair of tweezers and the paint is because the painting is dry I guess I should have sh shaken that up a little more. Let's see if we can get the rest of that out of there without causing too much distress. Although I do just want to wipe that up. I'm going to dampen my studio rag, which I should have dampened in advance. 
maybe a little spongy thing. Just pick that right up out of there so I don't have to think about it again right now. All right, so give that a much better shake. Grab a little container. That's my airbrush, which I never remembered I've plugged before I start lately. Add some dots. Because I don't mind the purple, I just don't want the glop or the whatever you want to call them. I definitely want some black. <clears throat> I might be I might be just using some of the black that I've got. Oh boy, I'm nervous. That's my Floetrol, American Floetrol. Looking for a small card. Mixed with some pre-stained wood conditioner from Minwax. And I've got to start somewhere and I hope it works and if it doesn't I guess I can always wipe it up. Looks like it wants to become a, uh, a geometric. I think it's time <coughs> to add some of this cell activator right into... Oh, I got a little tab of paint on my swipe card. I don't want that there. Now I'm going to do a little bit of this yellow too. I did a painting where I covered over everything with my black, but it wasn't cell activated black. But it's still kind of fun to play with. The idea. That was some more of that turquoise. I have to make sure I have enough paint. Because the canvas is dry. I think I'm gonna have a good time with this. I'm probably gonna go through a lot more cell activator than I gave myself for. And I'm either gonna like those gaps or I'm gonna fix them. And maybe, proving right there, maybe I don't need to put black cell activator on everything in order to get an interesting effect. Just a few things. <clears throat> I'm not hating it. I'm actually kind of liking it. Get some of my bottles out of the way so I can level my canvas. I didn't use much of this Anita's White Metallic. It has pink in it. I'm going to try some of the magenta from Golden with it. I might try a little gold too. Definitely going to be making up some more cell activator pretty quick though. Yeah, I did. I kind of like that spiral and I maybe shouldn't have run it off the road like that. Just using the residual paint on my card. 
and again. Less is more, so I have a, a more sheer effect. I'm going to steal some of that white paint. Drag this down that way. Dab that out that way. I might want some white cell activator, actually. I don't leave a lot, whole lot behind when I eradicate those marks. I don't want to use any cell activator because I want to see what kind of colors I get blending. I just got to do this. It's going to look more like a circuit board than anything. Let's grab some purple. And some of that neon pink. No, I'm not hating it. I'm liking using up the residuals on my card. I think I'm being called to some, uh, can I find it? The Venetian blue. a little spot first. Although that might lend itself to the white cell act ooh the white cell activator very nicely. Let's see if I I love that. Blue with the orange. I mean I really love that. This is getting kind of exciting. <laughs> I like it a lot. So let's grab some more white. Let's use a little maiden white. The cell activator and see how that works. So far, I haven't been doing that. I kind of want to put some some pink in these marks here. That's too big. Let's grab a tiny one. And a little bit of, where'd you go, hot orchid? There we go, you're hiding from me. I'm going to just put it right on my little acetate tool and see how I like it. Yes, I like it. I kind of want to do that with some gold, too, because there isn't very much gold in here. Yeah, I'm doing it with the Residual turquoise still stuck to it. Just stamping a little texture and I like it. Stealing a little paint from anywhere it looks like is willing to give it up to me. I 
I don't know what to do with that pink yet. Maybe some Venetian blue. I'm just making marks now. Oh, it looks like it's going to rain. It's very black outside. I just noticed there wasn't very much light left. So let me grab my original tool if I can find it. Or not. I want some more black over here. And I'm going to use some of the blue too. I just found some paint with my foot. Still okay. And almost done too, I think. Ah, I found my other swipe card. That's what my foot was sticking to. So I kind of like the orange. The yellow orange. Yeah, I think I'm just going to keep putting some some of that down in my dish and uh, adding it. I got two minutes to tell you guys look for my email address underneath the link tree underneath the video if you're interested in inquiring about a class at the house in Spring Hill, Florida with me or purchasing an artwork. I think I'm going to call this pretty good. I don't think it needs a whole lot more, except for maybe some more of this in here, because I really like that a lot. Maybe something else. Over there, because I had the paint anyway. Not sure what this is representative of, but it's definitely representative of some fun right now. Thank you for joining me. Please know that I have 2200 videos and they are organized by topic and genre and you can find them by going to playlists, solo playlists, creative playlists. I want a little bit of hot orchid right there. A little more right there. Oh, I've got yellow on my card. I wonder what that will do. Something interesting, maybe. I really didn't add any more orange to this. I guess that's okay. Whoops. If my bottle's in the way. I am enjoying the process. You guys are going to be gone in a second. When my timer goes off, I'll have one more minute to re remember whatever it was I was going to tell you. And the ha ha, see? There it is. So thank you for the donations that help keep me painting. Thank you for watching the videos, giving me a thumbs up, watching them longer, watching them when notifications come out. It's all pretty much a moot ceiling, feeling a lot like a moot point to me lately because there's a problem with views and subscribers. Nothing's happening. But uh, those of you who are left here, you inspire the heck out of me. So I guess I'm here until I'm not. <clears throat> it's just the way it goes sometimes with life. And then I'll do something else. Because I can. The name of my first book next to my second book on the Amazon link on the link tree. The link tree is directly under the video. <coughs> And should you happen to want to go there, you find Pinterest, Instagram, and Twitter links. I love you guys. I hope you come again. I post seven days a week still. I am having a good time stealing paint and making marks. And I think I'm done because this was fun. I 
I think I'm done except for this over here is kind of bugging me. So I'm going to 